We're continuing bug snacks. Uh, how far was I in last run? I got six out of the 12 people. I don't know if that's the last of the campaign. Snacksburg. I guess I'll keep getting the other six as well. Turn Kamado's feet into big popsicles. Wait, where are the popsicles? Maybe he knows? Hey, Komodo, uh, where are the, uh, things? If you make both my feet into big bopsicles, uh, then walking the hot sands would be a breeze. But I gotta warn you, you won't find bopsicles in the desert. Better look elsewhere, pal. So there's gotta be, like, a snowy region. That campfire we had, did that open up a new area? Bunga 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 Is there a new area open by the windmill? I remember there's a loud bang, but I thought it was just you, that weird guy broke into the building. Hi there. Oh, the bridge is knocked down. Sugar Pine Woods. That doesn't seem like it's cold enough. What a nice little area. Hunnaby. These snacks will stick to just about anything, including traps. <laughs> well, if you say that. <sighs> oh, wait. Oh. Uh. Doing that. The fuck is that? Is that an Oreo? There. A little bit of this. Eh. Uh, who wants to get it? Well, that didn't work. The fuck? I don't even want to know what that is. Is that the popsicle? Aim at that thing, right there. Launch. Gotcha. I just want to fill out my Pokedex. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Oh, wait. I do want to do something real quick. So currently, one of the things I hate, you have only six slots for your inventory. I did look up there is a way to get more. And it involves one of the side quests. Oh, hi there. Talking to me? Uh it's with this guy, I think. How you doing? <sighs> I suppose so. Even though we're home, the little ones are still restless. I think they might be getting lonely. After all, the barn used to be chock full of bug snacks. I'd be real grateful if you donate a few more bug snacks to my barn. Maybe a half dozen or so? <laughs> a wiggle, 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 wiggle. So, you put... I don't need any of these. The size of your heart has grown and so is your inventory space. Keep donating and keep growing. Okay. Oh, they actually come here. Can I pet the bunger? <laughs> You're a good oh, bunger. Oh, they're all so cute! Thank you so much. Hopefully, my little ones will settle down. The fuck is that? Maybe I can even start oh, training the them again. Orange. Did I give you these? Oh, these are the ones you wanted me to get for you. So now, can you get oh, rid of hi. these? I'm petting a fucking drink. Okay, so if you keep donating more, you get more space. Only two slots. Well, at least I have eight slots free now.
Okay. Uh, you. What are you? Quirky. So fast that we evade capture, there must be a way to trip it up. What was that? Honeygoop. This sticky glob of honey is evidence of a bug snack. This bug snack seems to appear at dawn, day, and dusk. I'm gonna assume it's the things I just caught. Is that a cinnamon roll? Cinna snail. Very slow, very sticky. It likes to stay out of, far out of reach. What is this? Peanut butter. Do you like peanut butter? What does it say? It loves chocolate. God, you are slow. I'm only really trying to catch one of you. Aha! Two for one. <laughs> Set of fail. Is that Oreos or s'mores? Mallow patch. This gooey cracker mess is evidence of a buzz crack only at night. Okay. What was this thing over here? Are you a popsicle? You're a big popsicle. Freezing anything that touches it, there must be a way to melt its icy armor. Uh, I'm gonna guess hot sauce? Also, I just heard something. What's in here? Nothing. Uh, I guess I'll try the hot sauce. Too big? Yep. Well, it hates something. What does it hate? Uh, are those like s'more flies? It was probably around here somewhere. Oh, hello. Chandler? Chandler? Snorpy? Chandlo. Snorpy! And Snorpy. Oh, Snorpy, get out here! I'm sorry, Chandlo. I'm not coming outside. I'm this close to finishing my next invention. Return to your lifting in peace. Snorpy, we talked about this, bro. You gotta go outside at least one hour a day. Gotta get some fresh air, dog. Uh. What you get is the attention of the Grumpernati. Who? There's nobody out here but us, bro. Better to work in the shadows where I cannot be seen. Also, it's cold out there. What are you working on in there? If you're not coming outside, I'm bringing the outside to you! No! What? You cannot lift my entire house! Oh, yes, I can! I'ma lift your crib, dog! Do not How lift strong my is this crib, guy? Tandlo. I have delicate instruments in here and. Lift in your crib, dog! There, I'm out in the fresh air. And I can smell the chemtrails. <sighs> That's right, bro. One step at a time. To be fair, the door would bring the fresh air in. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. I want to work on one crump at a time. Oh. So, do I need the big popsicle or just like a normal size popsicle? Because the fact that it says... It's big, but make me think that. Oh God! Sprinkle peed. Likes to climb. Oh! What the fuck? You break it? <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. I've turned them into big popsicles. How would you cool them off then? Alright, what was this thing? 
Maybe some salt scared to move. It loves chocolate. And coconut? How long am I? Is that a crossbow? I cannot interact with anything in there. What is that? Hmm. What is making this trail? Launch pad. Not a bee scoop. Basketball. Well, I'm guessing that's going to be a challenge for him. Who's making this trail? I'll oh, probably get a big popsicle to run into that. Let me go bring the that idiot these. See if that works. Another basketball over there. What do you hate? No, not that. Maybe only maybe something comes out. It must be at night. Because whatever that thing is, it looks like a s'more. And the bug that the popsicle hates looks like a s'more fly something. Snor Snormith? What could be a weird name? S'more fly? Fly s'more? So a moth? Let's at least bring them these, see if it works. I know you said big bop, big bopsicles. How you feel about these ones? Oh, okay. Those work. They're just the sticks. Sweet relief. These things better not melt off. Anyway, a deal's a deal, friend. The bridge is yours. Some assembly required. Oh yeah, yeah. Whoa. Oh, and so you know. Crumdamart is not responsible for any loss or injury Did suffered it break as a result again? of the use of its products. Hey, if you need anything else, anything at all, please, please, please call your friend Crumdo. Oh, I'm already sweating. It's too hot. It's too hot. Oh, I don't Then why'd you come to the desert, you idiot? All right. Uh, what was that? Oh, Bob's sake. I mean... So you have to go over now? Probably not. Let's go interview this guy and go back to the pines. So there's five more missing. There's Chanlo, this other guy, and three more? Who are the three? I don't know. Guessing one's Egabel. Hey, Trippany. What's going on? Hi. And, uh,. Who knows about the others? To what do I owe the honor? Oh, I'm just curious what you think you're doing here. What am I doing? I'm working the counter. Cromdomart's back in business, baby. Don't act all innocent. If you start running scams again, I'll know. Yeah, yeah, because you know everything. Hello, Christopher. And here's what I know. You're not better than me, Beth. Nobody likes all your snooping around. I don't care what they think about me, as long as I make sure you get what you deserve. Don't I always? Are you gonna buy something or what? Yeah, I'll take a tall snack water extra fizz. Coming right up. You think these two used to bang? All right, let's oh, interview you. All right, I could use some practice. They'll be interviewing me every day when I'm a gazillionaire. <laughs> Same with a real number, moron. Okay, who are you? Business King, Sales Savant, future CEO of Starbugs, the one, the only, Crondo Face! Uh, just the name would have worked. You ever smell the future, kid? Huh? I can tell you. 
Lisbeth stank of opportunity. She came on TV talking big about this new superfood, and I wanted in. So I quit my dead-end job and followed that stench of possibility. Okay. You're playing too? It's a fun game. I'm really enjoying not being able to eat the bugs myself. Making the people look weird, though. What was your dead-end job? Uh, I used to go door-to-door -door selling gruel to grandmas. Paid on commission, for grump's sake. All right, your thoughts on bug snacks. What do I think of? Delicious, irresistible, marketable. They're gonna catapult me straight to the top of Money Town, baby. And why'd you leave? Yeah, I tried to make use of what Lisbeth didn't need anymore, and Befica didn't like that. Yeah, she went and told everyone that I'm a thief. Why would she do that? Weren't you stealing? I was salvaging. That's a community service, pal. But Befica planted evidence in my hut. Said I stole her diary. So I did what any honest grump would do. I ran. Spoken like the honest man himself. Any info? Ooh, don't get me started. Everyone here thinks she's so great. Such a fantastic leader. But I know the truth. She came here to stroke her ego and get Eggabel her fix. The rest of us were just... Pfft, Disposable. Disposable? That's pretty cold. That's Elizabeth Megafig. When push came to shove, she abandoned us. Your backpack's full. I just found out that if you do some uh, missions for same Gramble, the guy at the farm, you can do a mission and then you donate some bugs, you can fill or get more backpack space. What do you mean? I gotta confess, I was thinking about sailing home after things got hairy. But when I went looking for our boat, it was gone. There's only two grumps missing. You do the math. Eh, I bet Liz and Egg are living large in New Grump City by now. Is there a New Grump City? Okay, bye-bye. Yeah, 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 I get it, pal. I'm not the nicest grumpus around. I learned no, early no. on that life is like a box of trash. You always know what you're gonna get. Trash. Just go check out where the boat was. See what you think of Lisbeth after that. This guy reminds me of Dan DeVito. Commit. Cop. How do you pronounce this guy's name? Chrome Doe gave you a map of the boat. Check the journal for details. Yeah, where's the lead? No. Uh. Boiling Bay? Have I been there? I don't think so. Also, why do we do the interview up here? Don't you have a house? Or a workshop? Or a thieves hey, hut? For your own little mart? Got anything good in here? Yard. Okay. Uh, was there an area? Nope, I haven't found it. Just go to the woods. Try and get those two. Hmm, which one first? Let's go with this guy. Whoa, it's you again. How's that sweet mountain air treating you, bro? Hate it. I want to go back to inside. It's easy in paradise. Easy for me, anyway. I'm Chandlo Funk Bun. With wisdom and lifting, <laughs> I got the full package. You feel me? No. <laughs> so if I gave this guy, like... So, if I gave him, like, french fry arms, would he just get s s tiny arms or, like, just... Still muscular fry arms? Uh, come back. Uh, I'm good. I mean, I like being in town, but it gives Snorpy mad anxiety. Why don't you talk to him? He's not good with strangers, so tell him I sent you. <laughs> so I'm guessing I get him back, I get you back. Okay. Uh, Chandlo oh, sent he me. he did, did he? My poor sweet Chandlo has this always... This guy's just eating all the foods. What is your business with me? Uh, come back. Hmm. I'm not 
disinterested, but you're still Grumpin a naughty. suspicious individual. I propose a test. Here, take my newest invention, the snack grappler. I built it so that I could help Chandler with his basketballing problem. But I forgot that meant going outside, so you do it, and then maybe we'll talk. So what does it do? Just grab? Can't grab right there. Come on. Alright, so we got on the wall over here. This guy's a conspiracy nut. Radio towers. Chemicals? Radio waves. Want to believe? Flat? <laughs> Mainstream pop music. Okay, maybe we don't want you back in town. Uh, yeah. Nice dog. I knew he'd warm up to you. All right, follow me. So can I just grab anything? Where where to go? Check it out. My own personal dunk zone. Problem is, I lost my balls. They're stuck all over the place. I'll help I'm you get sure your balls back. Don't worry. Your help, but Snorfy made that grapple thing for me, and I want to see it in action. I do plan on getting it. I'm gonna jump over there and climb that tree. Can I get that thing? Hmm. Oh. No. <laughs> Okay. I have to make the baskets? Why? Can I just give them the ball? Nice shot, bro. I'm gonna ball up there. Oh, no, no. Does this count? <laughs> Where's the other one? Going along. Come on. Nailed it. Where's I gonna go? Oh, it doesn't count. Shit. What the hell is down there? Is that like another area? Or is that like a completely new other town? And swish. Your balls have been secured. All right, you got my balls back. That grapple thing is awesome. I bet it can grab all kinds of stuff. Snorpy's a genius, bro. Check can it especially out. grab There's balls. A snail right over there. I know it looks like a sticky dump truck full of cars, but it's actually a master climber. Even I can't keep up with it. I always wanted to climb like that. Hey, see if you can catch me that cinna snail, bro. I think I got another one in my pocket. I do. <laughs> oh. oh wait, can I catch this one by the chocolate? You have to distract it before you can catch it. How does this work? I like some peanut butter. What if I douse in the chocolate? Come here. Okay, whatever. I already have one. Uh, how does your hands look? Pretty big. Oh, yeah. I feel stronger already. Watch me vert climb right out of here. Race you back to the cabin. Oh, I'm stuck down here. Wait. Go, go, go. Is this how to get up? Closer?
Did he really shut the door on me? Come on. Ah, what the hell? I'm gonna guess I can't go that way. This way? Got weights. Do I just go down? Nope. How the hell do I leap? Oh. That was really simple. And when did it get so dark? Charmelo. This snag is literally on fire. Put some water or ice some water or I should put it out. So can you two like put each other out? What's that thing, love? No, not you. You love chocolate and peanut butter. Wasn't me. Hmm. Oh, you froze the little guy. Hey, listen, I'm just trying to get you caught by this other thing. Are you not at all interested? Maybe you can't get the... Oh. Can you not catch the big version? He's gonna pop. Wait, is in the journal? Is it just the one? Uh. Grump. Bug. No, you could catch it. How do you catch it? Hmm. Where did I see this? You made it! You got back pretty fast for a newbie. Me, I got the same time I always get. I guess one bug snack isn't enough to push my limits. There's gotta be more sinus snails around this mountain, dog. <laughs> Want two more? So how the how the hell would I get over there? Or how do you catch these things? Can I catch you? I know you're on fire, but... Grab his foot! Do you like have to do something? Hmm. Stop running, come here! I don't think I get how this works. It's distracted now. Come on. How does this thing work? All right, screw it. Old fashioned way. I scared him. Hey, got more for you. Oh, wait. I wonder. Wait, what is that? Good. 
Oh, that works. What? I just picked up a rock. What, what do you do? So is that how we just have to catch them? I got a feeling there's going to be one of those little guys over there. Going? How to get cheese puff? Uh, which one is that? Cheese, cheese poof? If this is the one you mean, um, you have to do the trick I just did. You put the trap on the launch pad, aim it at the thing, shoot the launch pad. Activate the trap midair. That's how I did it. And then you pick it up. Are you in the thing or not? Oh, what the? Get it. <laughs> Yellow peel book. Uh, can I bring it back? Did I get two of the, the cinnamon things? I did. I want to see that swole arm. Show me it. Yeah. Uh, well, it's swirly, so it looks like a muscle. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I can't wait to check my gains. But before that, I got a situation. This guy just wants everything. Flew off with my backup balls. Now my balls are up in the sky. No matter how shredded I get, I can't fly. Believe me, I've tried. You gotta be my wings, dog. Master that grabber. Catch me those honeybees. <laughs> okay. Uh. There's only like three of them over here. Where'd they go? At least daytime they're out. Uh, probably. Dawn, day, and dusk. What is it right now? Night? Probably. Wait, didn't he have a bit up there? Probably did. Damn it. I need a bed. Someone give me a bed. Get up. <laughs> this is my bed. Wait. Oh. Were you taking pictures of me sleeping? Effica, what the? <laughs> and now she's running. She's trying to blackmail me. Ugh, oh, devil you? little bitch. What are, you at? what are you looking at? Okay. Did I get you guys last time? Oh yeah, they'll stick to anything. Are they going to stick to this? You say stick to anything. This does not count. They'll stick to the hook. Okay. Too early. I don't feel like walking. Uh, just stay locked up. That's one. Yeah, 
There's two. Why is this guy so excited? I want to know how to catch the big one. It hates those things, but... Melted icy armor? There were those guys in the other area that had the, uh... Fireballs. I don't know. I don't think you can bring one snack to another area. This guy wants so much food. Oops. That's just a honey pot? <laughs> Get the whole leg. Oh, crap. My body's tingling. I think that's the power. Bro, you really did me a solid. If you want me back in town, I'll be there. But I ain't going anywhere without my main dog, Snorpy. He'd be lost without me. I can't get Snorpy to leave, though. Whatever's keeping him here, he doesn't want to talk to me about it. Says it's a secret project. But I got a feeling he'll talk to you. <laughs> How come, like, when they talk, it looks like their... Looks like their mouth is just unhinged, but the bottom jaw is locked. Just like, the, from the jaw up, they're just like the top of their head's moving. So it's like they're talking like this. Okay, how do I get you back into town? Ah, yes. I wish I could tell Chandler everything, but knowing the truth would only put him in more danger. Anyway, you have my thanks for helping him. Perhaps I can trust you after all. I am Snorpington Fizzlebean, engineer and seeker of truths. Here, new chum, lean in close so that I may bestow a hug on you. Ah. This is too close. Ah, what an excellent hugging experience that was. We shall have to do that many more times. Now, I need your help. Are you willing to risk your life for the greater good? No. But I would die for you. Splendid! There is another device you will need. I've hidden it inside the Bugwatch Tower. Once you have it, I will tell you more. I was already up there. Don't trip. What do you got up there? Uh... That's her? Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Ah, that's right. I planted a radio tracking device on you during our mutual hugging. Now we How can could you? Securely. I trusted you. Beware. The Grumpinati are always listening. Hang on, where's that donut? Doubt I can get all the way down there. Can I just do this? Wait, where is it? Oh. <laughs> and launch. <laughs> Let's see if I can get it down. <laughs> What do you like? Chocolate? And peanut butter? What the hell just happened? Oh, is this the path? Alright, I'm guessing it'll come back. Where did it go? Oh, here it comes. No, no, no. Walk over. Why'd you do the whole lap? Did you get hit by the little... Bro, I got hit by the big guy. Shit. Peanut butter. Oh. What? Why didn't that work? I just wasted everything. 
All right, get ready. <laughs> Here it comes. Oh, he's still rolling. He's on the wrong side. Okay. <laughs> I need more sauce. Was there peanut butter in this area? There you are. The hell happened over here? You okay? Yeah, he'll be fine. Okay, you. This time it's gonna work. Are you not interested in the donuts? But you are a donut. You get to stop. All right, still rolling. So, how do I get it to ten? How would I get its attention all the way down here, though? Do you smell that? You know, whatever. Let's just... What is that? Oh. Let's we'll just get this tool. Oh, now it's open. Ugh, one of those flying bug snacks has set off the tower's alarm system again. Not to worry. With my trip shot device, you can disrupt the snack's movement. Okay, trip shot. I got all the tools. Boy. How does this work? Hey, what? What am I aiming at? Get back here. Oh. Okay. You have to get bullseye? This is not what I'm supposed to do. I'm supposed to catch this thing? I'm on fire. <laughs> is that what I'm supposed to do? I don't think it's supposed to be on fire. Oops. <laughs> okay. How we do this? <laughs> Try this. get down. Is that not? I think this game will get this complicated. <laughs> you have to set it on fire? Oh. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Get it. Get it. Oh, no. Okay. I'm going back up.
They're making these puzzles too complicated. Ah, chum, I have such a craving for quookies. Why, my craving is so terrible that I would like my teeth to be quookies, so that I may taste my own teeth, you see. Seems like you'd be able to bite those pretty easily off. Oh, so now you could do the nose and shit? Ooh, <laughs> splendid! I no longer have to worry about psychotronic torture or cavities. But now I hunger for charm mallows. Can't ever have enough charm mallows. <laughs> Wait, how did I catch one? Oh, I think I knocked it out with the, uh... The big guy. Here's your nose. <laughs> okay. <laughs> God, this guy's a literal, mo literal monster. Oh, wait. Someone down here? Uh oh, uh oh. No, oh no, I'm frozen. Where am I? Oh, still going down. Okay. Shut up. What's that? What's that? Gotcha. No, I don't. That's the big guy. I'm not here. Don't look at me. No, no. Leave me alone. I'm gonna find out how to melt you one of these days. Oh, he's still mad. Hey, can you handle this guy? He's getting pretty mad. Come on. Are you done? Oh god. Okay, uh... What is that? Your head? <laughs> With that blind spot in place, I can safely return to Snacksburg. Meet me outside. Where's your hat? Hmm. <laughs> this guy seems clear to me. Oh, it's not above him. I suppose it's now or never. Oh. Snorpy's ready to go? All right, dog, let's do this. In just a moment, Chandlo. You've been an invaluable ally. I'm even tempted to call you a friend, but quietly, so I'm not overheard. Bro, if I didn't think it'd crush you like a tin can, I would hug the grump out of you. I'm good. Oh, what the grump? Here it comes! Why are these two such what huggers? expert hugging that is. You do that hug. All right, let's get out of here. Race you back to town, Snorp Dog. No, please don't make me run with you, Chandlo. I'll go weak in the knees. If you're not up for it, I could always carry you. D no, no, that's quite all right. Your loss. See you back in Wait. town, bro. Chandlo. Okay. Got two of them. I want to beat you back there. That cinnamon and swirl leg ain't doing nothing. Cinnamon and swirl, cinnamon bun. The Simmons roll. And technically, it's a squirrel. Break time. Okay, before I do that, let's interview these two. Ooh, gonna quiz me, dog? I'll crush your questions. Okay. Who are you? Chandlo Funkbun. I lived. Your last name's Funkbun? Why can't anyone? Why can't everyone give me these answers? Your name? Oh, two-word sentence about you. It's a way of life, bro. Anything that needs to go up. Logs, buildings, balls, Snorpy. I'll get him there. This guy just loves balls. Why come? If I want to push my limits, I gotta go somewhere extreme. I heard nobody comes back from this island. Sounds like a challenge to me. That's not a good thing. <laughs> that means they all die here. Did you see the bodies of skeletons Tiffany's been finding? Hey, I'm always looking out for Snorpy. I know Ruffin it isn't his style, but there's no way I was coming here without him. 
All right, how did you two become a thing? I don't know what you mean, dog. We're like the sky and the sea. Been together since the dawn of time. Well, technically the dawn of time was there before you were. But whatever. What are your thoughts on bug snacks? Bug snacks are strong. Like a primal kind of strong. Like they own this place. And I gotta respect that. Okay, why'd you leave? Because the snow peak was a disaster without Lisbert. I couldn't stop all the fighting with lifting or wisdom. I got punched one of them. Chill for Snorpy. He's got a lot of that social anxiety. All right, any info? Lisbert is top dog. You feel me? She really inspires me to test my limits. But uh, that's about it. I'm really tighter with Egabel. What about where were you tell me about her? Egabel's a sweetie. She was always looking out for me. Showed me how to stay safe while still pushing my limits. But she was always pushing herself way harder. She was working out? Yeah. She asked me to train her. Surprised the grump out of me, because she really wasn't built for that kind of stuff. We'd go running every morning and lifting after lunch. Though she would get real down on herself sometimes. But she never gave up. And I respect that. What are those sounds? What happened to both of them? I wish I could tell you. Those two were strong together. I can't think of anything that could take them down. They gotta be okay out there. Somewhere. Okay, that's it. Bro, that's not... Just... Don't. Anyway, I recorded Egabel's progress while we were working out. She shared some pretty private stuff. Maybe it'll help you bring her back to us. Don't let me down, bro. Uh, Agabo's chest key. Oh, was that her chest? I guess her and Lisbeth were living together. Nope. Uh, a syringe? She juicing? Another video diary? Yeah, might as well watch it. Damn, one thousand. <laughs> you scoping my form? Egg? Uh, hey. uh, she is very far behind. Hey, Egg, bro. Good workout today. Let's hit the showers. No. This is pathetic. I won't break yet. Oh, Maybe because you got boring. French fry arms. She is covered. I'm saying you aren't doing this for snacks alone. I can't help you if you're not honest with me. I'm just so sick of feeling like an empty shell. Is that a cactus on her right I thigh? Stop relying on everybody else. I want to keep up with Liz. For Where's a uh, pickle? Respect. I know things are tough with Liz right now. But dog, she loves you. You two will be back to normal in no time. But I don't want to go back to normal. I don't want her worrying about me anymore. <laughs> when you love somebody, you never stop worrying about them. I know. And I'm worried about her, too. I just want to take better care of her. And that starts with me. Yeah, I get that. And I will get you there. Thanks, Chanlo. And, uh... Maybe I'll hit the showers after all. I smell rotten. Okay, so she doesn't want that. What am I trying to say? The words are there, but they're mixed up. She doesn't want to solely rely on Lisbert for snacks. Uh, okay, I'll be back in one second. Maybe one minute. Okay. Uh, break time. Philbo wants to talk to you. This guy's always sleeping. Sure, it's midnight, but... And stay up one night. How's it going? You're doing a great job, buddy. But, hey, 
don't forget to take care of yourself. In fact, I haven't eaten maybe anything. You turn in early today and just relax. I have not eaten anything since I've been here. I can't even eat the snacks. Huh. What? Something's wrong, buddy. We better take a look. Oh, I forgot to interview. Uh, what's his name? I'll do that after. Bethika, Ramble, what happened? We saw something real spooky walk right into town. I thought it was a grumpus at first, but like something about it was wrong. Was this creature wearing a crown by any chance? Or was it perhaps holding some sort of ceremonial dagger? What? No, no nothing like that. It looked kind of normal until it... <laughs> until it... It turned into a bunch of bug snacks and like scattered. Frankly, I find that hard to swallow. Ah, what a load, Biff. Not enough drama around town for you lately, huh? Zonk off, Cromdo. Unlike you, I don't lie for a living. Oh, wow. So tell me then, what were you doing skulking around at midnight? Breaking in the huts? Again? I seen it too. And this time I know it's not just one of my nightmares. Who wrote Get that? Get some grump and sleep, Gramble. I can't. Not with all of y'all around here with your hungry mouths. Don't take this the wrong way, darling, but you are a bit high strung. A little beauty sleep would do you wonders. Maybe then you'd finally let us eat a few pets. You say that again. No, get off me. Stop. Whoa, hey. Just bite the fries. Out, bros. There's no need for all that. If what Gramble and Befica are That was the most intense cool, fight I've seen. There's gotta be some physical evidence left behind. Yeah? Indeed. We should sweep the perimeter and keep watch in case the creature returns. Um, uh, good idea. Uh, buddy, do you think you can scope out the restroom? You know, find out what they saw? <laughs> was it in the restroom? Was with these stars? <gasps> Their footprints. If toilet paper found it, this is what they found. <laughs> Catch. It's again the area for clues. Shovel. Oh, wait, death tag. Yeah. A rusty spade is guarded near the sign. Smells like snacks. Did they do this? The words known where bug snacks are carved crudely into the camp sign. Broken lock. Lock has been busted open. Something got inside the ranch. Are the pets fine? They're gone. They're all gone. Even the ones I donated. Messy paw like prints lead to the edge of Snacksburg to the garden. Oh. Farm. More paw prints. Bug prints. And also, I found the toilet paper. We're good, everyone. You found what you were looking for? All right, I'll call everybody together. Uh, sure. Found a lot of footprints. Well, wh wh what did you find? Uh, it's probably aliens. Well, that's, um, I reckon there's got to be some other explanation. Cram it, Wampo. We gotta but to be fair, footprints boy. change mm, often. Monsters, a bit of a prejudicial term, don't you think? I'd call it more of a cryptid or undiscovered animal. It's no animal, darling. We're witnessing the queen of bug snacks in action. She's given us a wand! Oh, that is absurd. Which is more likely, that a so far unseen giant bug snack politely left a note on our door, or that this is some form of coordinated gaslighting by the Grumpenar- What's more likely, dear, is that you've watched far too many movies. Well, at least my theory has scientific data behind it, whereas you haven't even drawn one chart. <gasps> I was top of the charts, thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know what? Let's split the difference, eh? You're both wrong. 
Uh, what does it even matter? Whatever it is, it wants us dead. Between this and the earthquakes, Snacksburg's becoming pretty unlivable. I hate to say it, bro, but I regret coming down from the mountain. Me and Snorpy were a lot safer before we came back. Same goes for me and my little ones. The guys are all out in the wilderness. We shouldn't split up again. We're better off if we're all here together. That might have been true when Lisbert was around, but those days are long gone. You don't know that. She might come back. <laughs> don't hold your breath, pal. Face it, Philbo. Without Lisbert, all we have is you. That's... that's... not true. Listen, you have each other. I don't know why Lisbert put me in charge, but I do know this. None of you were really happy out there alone. We don't have Lisbert, but we have each other. Maybe if we try, we could all add up to one of her. <sighs> I guess you're not wrong. So we're all staying in town then? Seems like it. As long as we can watch each other's backs. If we're gonna make it, we need everybody here. Floofty and Sheldar are still out there, and, and who knows if they're safe. If you must find Floofty, according to the tracking device I placed on them, they're out by Boiling Bay. Why do you have a tracking time device? I saw Shelda, she was meditating in the sizzling sands. But don't forget about Egabel. If she's not with Lisbert, we gotta find her. We will, Chandlow. And once we do, we'll throw a big welcome back party. How does that sound? Oh, okay. Great. Now let's go get some sleep. Okay, so what was it? Boiling Bay and uh, hi. Uh, what did I want to do? I want to interview someone. Where's the scientist? Where's that guy at? Uh, there you are. One, two, three. That's enough, Chandlo. You're going to make he your actually biceps moved it. explode. I'm not stopping, dog. I almost got it. You know, I could just make a digging device. Uh, that's not the point, bro. I can do this. If you insist. I'll go ready some ice packs. Okay, interview time. Are you mad? I can't have my secrets plastered all over the front page news. Hmm. I suppose I can reveal a tad bit. So that looks like it's attached to the basketball. <laughs> okay, who are you? <clears throat> I am Snorp Redacted. Me. I have devoted my life to inventing devices that foil the machinations of the Grumpinati. All right, well, I come to this when place. I was dragged here by my dearest friend, Chan Redacted. He thought I needed some fresh air or something. Much as I hate the outdoors, I simply can't say no to him. How long you? How long have you and Redacted been in a relationship? I, I, I mean, we've been together since kindergarten. It would make perfect sense if we were together, together. He's never said we are, has he? I think he has. I surmise they are some sort of synthetic life form designed to beguile our taste buds. And if they are artificial, where do they come from? I'm so glad you asked. I believe there may be a factory located on this very island, hidden somewhere deep underground. I have charts. Let me show you my charts later. No, uh, you don't have to. So it's not like it's not like a mama strub strawberry and a daddy strawberry get together and they just are made from a factory. I was too exposed. Floofty tried to wrap me up in that experiment. Now that Lizbert and Agabel weren't around to occupy them, I could see that this was the next step in the Grumpinati's plot against me. Grumpinati plot. Lisbeth disappears, we are hit with an earthquake, we suffer a snack shortage, all that in one day. Do you really think these are all coincidences? The timeline is on my charts. Okay, any info? Elizabeth Megafig was a curious sort, and had a foolish bone in her body. She could rival me in wits, 
and chat redacted. Blow and arm wrestling. We would share secrets now and again. Dreadful, terrible secrets. What kind of secrets? <laughs> I'm not telling you the terrible secrets because they are terrible and secret. Okay, thanks for nothing. Excellent interrogation, chum. So great that you deserve another hugging experience. Ah. No. <laughs> hey, this must not go on the record. Elizabeth Megadry discovered something on the island that came to me for help. An entrance to the underground, locked behind a strange device. I assisted her in unraveling its secrets, and soon after, she vanished. You must take extreme caution. I can tell you where to find it, but the rest is up to you. Snarpy gave you a map to a mysterious door. Well, thank you. Why couldn't you just put that in the, uh, <laughs> in the record? Um, near the mountain peak, hang left from the trail to a narrow ledge. Okay, I'll worry about that later. Uh, oh wait. I never did this. Are these both in the pines? No, I haven't been to the mountain peak. I've been there. And I'm about to go there. Let's go figure this map out. So, I'm about where it starts. Just keep going, right? Oh, hey. Ooh. You picked up a video diary. This is the last one. Looked like there were only four slots. I also really thought I heard something. Why are there pillows here? Okay, let her fly, and I'll show you my incredible aim. Just try not to hit Bilbo again. When you're finished with your amusement, come see me. We have work to do. Get out of here, Lucy. You're ruining my shot. What's wrong? There's something off about that grumpus. Lucy's not so bad. They're just passionate about science. Sure, science. I heard about their experiment, messing with your body. It's weird. What's weird about it? I mean, look at you. How many bug snacks have you had? Hey, in my professional medical opinion, I am perfectly healthy. Thought that's your body. We're all eating bug snacks, and we're all fine. So, why are you getting on my case? I'm just worried, Bill. You're not acting like yourself. You mean I'm not miserable? found a way to make myself useful and happy to finally take some control over my life and you're just upset because it doesn't involve you i'm not upset if you don't need me anymore that's great go be with lucy maybe i will i mean i don't know if there's any more how's it going out of my way yeah we got some more of these might as well Okay, search the frosted peak. I don't even know where to go for that. Will that be somewhere off Sugar Pine? Maybe the bridge is fixed somehow? Let's go check that first. Or no. Hello, Tiffany. It would definitely be this way. Oh, nice to see ya. I'm away. I don't know how you fix the bridge.
Maybe left something in his house I could take? Spotted downtown. What's been spotted? Cryptid? Oh. Wow. Five hours go by pretty fast when we're working together, Wambi. And now that the avalanche is cleared away, we can go explore the top of the mountain. Trivi, I'm almost 50, and my back's at least 100. Let's go lie down for a spell. Don't worry, I'll go first. Frosted Peak. Was there anything over here I needed? Or on the map? Not the map. Any of the clues I have? No, it's Boiling Bay. More peanut butter. What is that? No, nope, Sodi. This bug washes away sauce and somehow stays unfrozen in the cold. I just... Is it this simple? Oh. Well. Oh, oh, the frames. You have to do it fast? Yep. Why do I lose frames when I go in the cold water? Ah. Oh. What the hell are you? Scoopy Panoopy. <laughs> it catches its prey in its four legs and freezes them. Get away fast. It loves chocolate though. Uh oh. You like chocolate? I don't have any. Sagable? Uh, you shouldn't be here. What happened to your eye? It's not safe. You need to get off this mountain for the sake of your health and well-being. Ask Trust her me, all I'm the questions. Doctor. Where'd you go, Bill? You know me? Oh, oh, you're the reporter. The one Liz was always talking about. I, I didn't think you'd really come out here. Why is it dangerous? Another what the hell is that thing? It'll cause an avalanche. If you're up here when that happens, you'll be buried in snow. And if you don't die from blunt force trauma, we'll asphyxiate. Aren't you in danger too? I can handle it. I've been up here for weeks on my own, doing fine. And what are you doing up here? I'm surviving. Okay, we come back. Not until I find Liz. What happened? We, we were exploring the mountain. There was an earthquake. We got separated. How can I'll I help? Go back home, okay? Be safe, and please don't tell anybody I'm up here. I'm gonna go screaming back into town. I found Agabel. Follow Agabel to discover her secrets. <laughs> but what if you didn't follow her? She does not seem to mind. I'm right behind her. I'm as quiet as a mouse. Is she living in an igloo? Is that secret door? Come on, Egg. You can figure this out. Just think like Liz. Ah! Stop sneaking up on me or I'll quarantine you. I'm already quarantined. Well, it's a big mysterious door and I want to open it. There's some kind of weird lock on it. Liz figured it out, but I don't know what happened to her notes. I've almost got it, I swear. I just need to get into Liz's headspace. <laughs> Find the missing page. Um, maybe Floofty has that. Oh, a nice little hut. That's the other main quest, right? 
Uh, correct. Good. Find shield. Oh yeah, never found her. I already marked that. Boiling Bay. I don't. Even, I don't even know how to get there. I don't have it, do I? Was it Boiling Bay and Sizzling Sands? No. Somewhere from the gorge. Where are the other bug snacks here? Any more interesting ones? Instabug. Instabug. This unusual shishka bug loves the spotlight. Oh, it loves camera. Can I just stare at the nope. It's the oh! oh! Son of a bitch. Peanut butter. What's up here? Butter jam. Is that, is that bread with jam? This elusive flyer is looking for its favorite sauce that it wants to be coated in it. Chocolate and fire sauce? Is that hot sauce? No. Chippy. Climbs as quick as lightning. Could be tripped right off the wall. Okay. What the hell is this? Stoodler. This boiling snack is a source of warmth and bitter cold. Loves hot sauce. If you turn it upside down, the stew does not fall out. That's impressive. Would you like hot sauce? Oh, shit. Oh, no. How do you catch? I don't know how to catch the ones that are on fire. Do you have to, like, lure them to the water? Too fast, even catch. Almost there. Oh. Oh. That was just chilly. This glob of jelly is evidence of bug snack. Bug snack seems to appear during the day. Is it not the day? Or maybe it's that one. Who are you? You're an old adventurer. Hello. Okay, well. Hopefully there's no fall damage. What was that? Oh, is that just more? Okay. Uh. Nailed. Got some real solid feet on this guy. Okay, I'll try and find the other two. So, how do you catch anything that can light on fire? There's no water. Oh, how do I get up there? Can this launch me up there? Maybe. Nutty snack bot. Back to Snacksburg. So you think it'd go from desert to the sizzling sands. And maybe the beach area to the bay area? Hey, you pal. Let's try this way first. Africa? 
What are you doing in Philbo's hey place? How's it going? Don't act all nice. What were you doing? We take. Why? What kind of. What is this thing on top? Can I see the other side? Okay. Stop taking pictures. What's up, dog? I'm gonna go into this girl's house later. She's gonna have pictures everywhere. Sorry about that. Who would have built the bridge? Maybe it's just randomly built? Oh my god, it is. Oh, channel mode. Hey, bro. Just got done fixing up the old bridge. Would have done it sooner, but Cromdo wanted me to pay him for the rights of repair. Whatever that means. Anyway, no need to thank me. Just go find Shelda, all right? Okay. So these are the last three, right? Agabelle, Shelda, and Floofty. And then wherever Lizbird is. Nope, not that. No, that thing flying. What is that? It's supreme. It looks like it can use a good slicing. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's a trip to the hospital. Oh wait, I didn't say it right. When the moon hits your eye like a big pizza pie, that's a trip to the hospital. You're a big one. Oh my god. Are you hitting me out of the sky earlier? Oh, what was that? Don't go anywhere. Come back here. Praying Picantus. Picantus? Large, aggressive, and destructive. Best be avoided. It's like if all my favorite foods hated me. I can't even tell what food. Oh, why is. Hey, attack! Nope. Oh, loaded buddy. He's pissed. Nope, oh, there's Shilda. Shilda? Score pepper. Oh, ow, oh. Okay, this place sucks. Where's our pyramid here? You're definitely going to open at some point. The hell's going on over here? Okay. Oh, you seem really zen. This one has many questions. So it is my wisdom shall be shared. Are you Shelda? One who is called Shelda exists beyond the cell. What's your deal? The questions must cease. Wisdom can be gained only through experience. One who is you, tainting others with the toxin that is bug snacks, have strayed from the mother's path. So it is. You must atone. Hang on, are you not eating bug snacks and are you like super like starved? In seeking inner peace, Shelda has renounced material temptations. So it is that Shelda is really grumping hungry. Seek the yellow sauce within the great maw of stone. On this I shall be sustained. <laughs> Get cheese sauce for Shelda. Do I have that? No. That's something new. Where is it? 
seek the yellow sauce within the great maw of stone. On this, I shall be sustained. Is that bacon and waffles? Flap Jack Crack. Go, 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 go. What is this? Inchirito. As long as it's under the sand, it can't be caught, but it can't dig through solid rock. Okay, so in the stone. Is that a pizza cutter? I mean, you would think it'd be like, you know, right here. Is there a way inside here? Uh, yeah. Nope. Hey, can you help me up? This probably won't work. Hello? Where is the yellow stuff? Maybe there's something that comes around later? So did I mean, you're easy to catch. Maybe something comes out at night? Buffalo Cust. Spicy menace dive bombs into favorite sauces. Okay. Just what I needed. Oh, God damn it. How do you go out? I need like an ice thing. <laughs> this guy fell head first. Ah, oh, just drop him. Uh. What you were holding? An empty pot. Where am I supposed to go? Venturios. A black raspberry. Uh, it will need help escaping the underground. Oh, I got you, little pal. Don't worry, I'm gone. Dumb bitch. I'm gonna get you out of here. How do I trigger you? Loves hot sauce. What just happened? Bunch of scorpion things. What was that? Wait, there's no things down here. There's no... Just no chase stuff. All I found in here was a raspberry. Or raspberry. 
the one on top then, maybe? Is there just that one flying around? Some egg? Strong egg. Maybe this one? This one seems like you have to open it manually. Holes anywhere? Hey, come over here. Oh, what's going on up here? I thought you liked hot toss. There you go. Oh, you're on fire. Please go out. Nope. So. Is there anything else this thing can dive bomb? Where do you get the yellow cheese? Inside the stone. You ain't really that specific. How dangerous are you? Okay. Here, catch. Can you give me the hint again? Seek the yellow sauce within the great maw of stone. On this, I shall be sustained. I would think it's this. Can you, like, open this thing? Can I get that thing to fly over here? I don't know if I can... drag it around. I don't think I can bait it. What if I can do this? Oh. Ah. Uh, this thing? Ah, cheese. How do you get up there? Wait, can you use this? Aha! Okay. Much easier than I thought it'd be. Ooh, the yum is one, and one is craving reapers. Consider the sandscape a reflection of the mind. One unable to escape its dry embrace. First, an act of rebirth to break out of my current shelter. So too must you break shells, crack open the egglers, give them new life. 
Talking about these eggs? How do you crack these? Maybe the spuddy? Oh. Without a shovel, this egg makes for an easy meal. Alright, I don't have to capture them, I just have to crack them. Yeah, where was that other one I was playing with? Hey, Spuddy! Spuddy. <laughs> Damn it. It's too smart. Whoa! That was my thing, uh! Okay, whatever. I cracked the two things. I too have burst from my shell and so oozes forth my spiritual yoke. Yet obstacles devour that yoke, the sinister peccantis of temptation. To truly destroy these obstacles, one must break them down into their elements. What are you talking about? Break to prank picantes? How the hell do you do that? You have to get them to fight the spuddies? There's no spuddies around. Just keep following me, buddy. God, they're all fighting. Oh. Oh, wait. Actually, I can use that. Ugh. Okay, you too. Come on. Spuddy, get over here. See this plays out. <laughs> oh, you son of a bitch. There we go. Wait, no, that didn't break it. Wait, what just happened? How'd the water go out? Okay, well, how would I break it? This buddy didn't work. Oh, there's one right here. Try it again. Hello. Can you come down? Maybe I can launch back him out of here. Maybe this? Air first fire. I mean, I can use that. God, can't you just fight each other? There we go. It's gonna get him. Break him again. How do you break them? Do you have to hit them twice? Hmm. Maybe the dive bombing things?
But they're not even near. What do I do with this thing? I don't even know. Alright, let's see if I can get one of you all the way over there. Hey, follow me. how that works. Wait, you're gonna blow up? I need you out of here. It's a cheap poof. Anything else? Pack roach, very timid snack. It seems easy to catch, very easy apparently. Oh, it's supposed to be a taco. Ah, uh, so to get out of her. So how would I get the sodi over to the buffalo cost? Is there anything else that came out of that? No, man, you weren't even. Oh god. <laughs> I don't know. I'll worry about. Trying to catch all these other things at another time. Okay, listen, I need all of you to fuck off. Leave him alone. You're all on fire. Focus on me. Hey, Sodi. All right, trying to attack me. Get him, Sodi. Hey, no. No, Sodi. He'll be fine. We got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. Bye bye. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, it's also an intro. Third. What is it? Get your reader. This stuff's getting more and more complicated. So there are sodies, I think, in every area, but I don't know how you get all of them around the fire things. Snack of temptation removed. Yet, one still lost in darkness, seeking the light. For only in the light of Mother Nature can the toxin be purged. <gasps> Seek a Rasby. I already did it. A hidden ruin, a maze of trials. Guide this Rasby to one's side. Wait, I have to guide it? But I already have it. It's in my backpack. I could just can I just give it to you? Damn it. Uh just feed it to you. How the hell am I supposed to guide this thing? Does it like something? It might like chocolate. It can also very much get attacked. Yep, loves chocolate. Please, like, stay in the area. Hurry up. Okay, well, you're safe for now. That's 
shit. You love something. You love hot sauce. Go over there. Oops. Okay, well, this is your new area, right? Okay, I'm gonna go get some more chocolate. Is there really no more chocolate patches? Oh, you're distracted by that one. Okay, you're good over here now. <laughs> you're welcome. God, why can't I have one in my pocket? Can I just hand it to you? was lost now is found the path to light determined the time has come egress from the sandscape so it is that shelter survives what it was a metaphor now to snacksburg goes me to bring such clarity to my followers thank god my grumpy butt is so sore. Oh, meet yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, go back to town, interview her, uh, trade these in, get, probably get one more or two more slots. And then, uh, flo Flofty, Flofty, whatever her name is, the weird scientist lady. So wait, is there a Sodi in this area? Scorch Gorge. Scorch Gorge. No oh, wait, no, there's not. Cause how would you get like the Scorpioneo? Is that cheese? Does cheese put out fire? <laughs> Oh, you could probably lure it to the water. Alright, let's set up a path. No, that's not for you, you old bastard. Alright, I'll worry about this another time then. It'll be complicated with these assholes around. all these in. So as the row has grown, so is your inventory space. Keep donating. 18. Oh wow, that's a lot more space. Is that four more? It is. What are you looking at? Why do I hear a raspy? Oh. Oh wow, you're calm. Come on, Charlie. Just follow Papa's pointer. Or or don't. That's fine too. That's right. We're off to a bit of a slow start oh, it went so easy with sprout i just i don't know what's going wrong now maybe maybe sprout can help i'm sure he could show charwi the ropes what do you say uh maybe later i want to see what this thing really is can i pet it no no not you 
You. I don't think I can. Oh. <laughs> is there a Dorito face? Is that what that is? It's got a Dorito face, taco arms, a burrito lower half. A what's that middle section? Is that the Cheeto part? I don't know. Okay, where is um Shelda? That's Floofties. This is Wiggle. Where would she have gone? There you are. Oh, Shelda's back. Wiggle and Gramble are gonna be so stoked. Ah, oh, yes, Swan has returned from a great spiritual soul journey. So it is. One would really like to lie down. Sounds intense. I bet you're overflowing with wisdom now. Go ahead and lay it on me, Shell Dog. Ah, yes, uh, wisdom. Um, the strength you seek cannot be found within toxins, for the truest strength is the will to resist. Oh, I get it. I gotta check my snacks, and if they look toxic, I won't eat them. One is not... You... Oh, clearly you need more guidance. Grump, yeah, I do. I'll bring the others, too. Oh, one is sure it will be enlightening. Okay. Um, uh, time to interview. When one asks questions, one may receive answers. Is that a yes? This is going to be a complicated interview. Who are you? One is called Shelda. A one who is me acts as a vessel for the will of Mother Nature. So it is. One maintains balance and purity. Okay, why'd you come snack tooth? <gasps> a calling felt in the soul. Distant voices say they need you. Three tickets won in a raffle. <laughs> Was Morel a raffle? A raffle is a metaphor. Uh, but yes. Not really a metaphor, it's a real thing. The toxin. The mother abhors them in all their alluring forms. One feels them crawling around us, beneath us, inside us. Who is the mother, anyway? Mother Nature! The mother! She, the purest light, from whom all life flows. Okay. Why'd you leave? One cast out they, the scion of toxins. Yet, lessons unlearned, the cravings only grew. So it was one journeyed far. To isolate oneself and live by example. So it was. One got very, very lost. So you're trying to make an example, but you got lost? She, the huntress, is gone from us. Strayed from the mother's path, chasing the healer's tainted love. Rice were they worn, so this once you shall be warned. A doom befalls those who consume the toxin. Oh, well, good news for me. I can't. Can you be more specific? A doom of toxin unending. The ground shakes. The sky splits. Look not upon it. Move not an inch or be swallowed. By the Queen of Venom. Or so I heard. You're a fraud, aren't you? Everyone is a fraud in a sense. So yes, okay, thanks. Ever are more questions asked, seldom are more answers given. One must live content with the absence of knowing. 
meditate on this. A vessel of the Where'd you pull that from? May answers be found in its mystery. A locked box. Do I have a key for that? No. Probably get that from a uh, flora. Can I see what's in there? Looks like googly eyes. What? Is there a snack in there? See that? That's an eye. This isn't a snack, is it? Okay. Flora. Or Flufta. Flufty? Flufty. Uh, Boiling Bay. Don't know where it is or haven't gone there yet. I'm gonna assume it's across Simmering Springs because it's like a bay area. Lofty! Lofty, where are you going? <laughs> She's a ghost! Kill her! Demon! Boiling Bay. Okay, before I do anything here, I have that map. Uh, okay, it's on the little penis lip. The other side. This is hot. That's lava. That's very hot. What are you? What's in there? A golden quibble. Exactly like the quibble, but with a distinctively golden shine. Freezes anything that charges at it. That might be useful against all the spicy bug snacks. Oh, I'm sure I can get this thing to walk in the fire. Oh, wait, no. How do I get him off? I wonder if I can get him with this. He's gonna break! Going for the big one, but I'll take you too. <laughs> La Sodix. That was just like LaCroix. A Sherby. A drill is beneath the sand, waiting to unleash frosty vengeance on its foes. <laughs> Who are its foes? I'm just a man. He picked up Liz's notes on a secret code. Oh. Oh, jeez. Fine, I'll leave you alone. So is that all the... Oh, the... That's right, this is it. First left, then right, then center. So I can go back and crack code. First I want to get Flufty, just so I get everyone else. It's just her, then Agabelle, then Lizbert. Hello. You took your precious time getting here. Any longer, and my leg might have rotted away. Come, let's finish our work. What were we doing? My experiment cost an arm and a leg, and nobody else was offering. Hm. What happened to your arm? They look fine. Absolutely not. I'm on the verge of a breakthrough. Now assist me or be gone with you. How can I assist ah, you? Always a question worth asking. Preparations for my grand experiment are nearly complete. Soon we will see if we can amend my ambulation. But for now, simply transform my arm into a red banapa. What the fuck's a red banapa? Got a thing here? There's a lot of stuff there. Uh, where am I? Bay. So 
making sure I didn't see it already, did I? Maybe that's it? It was like a banana. Oh, treasure chest. Who looted this? Is that what I'm going for? Green crapple. Hello. Okay, bye. More googly. What? Is this gonna turn out that like these are just normal f foods? And then they're just putting googlies on it to make them come alive? Is that how it's gonna turn out? Hiding tree. Ah, that is it. Uh, the trip shot could be useful here. Also, it is red. <laughs> Did I ever find one of these? Okay, what is it like? Chocolate and peanut butter. Get it out of the air. No, what are you doing? I need you out of here. Hmm. Oh, the trip shot. Can I douse this? Did I do that? Uh, try from here, maybe. Oh. What? Is that too far? Nope, it ain't working. Maybe it needs to be higher? thing under the goddamn tree. The crimson color may be caused by excess. That doesn't help me. The trip shot is useful. Can you get like higher? Hmm. I can't barely go that high up here. Here's the sweet spot. You 
can you just hit it out of the air? Oh, hello, Anthony. Uh, I'm trying to catch this goddamn banana thing. I got no idea how. Don't mean to use a trip shop, I got no idea what I'm doing. It's not even high enough. Yeah, the game is very wacky. People eat snacks and then their body parts become those snacks. And the snacks are alive. Gonna hit that? Nope. Yeah, you know, probably for some people. Some people probably go on an adventure like this when they take a high trip. chocolate. Apparently this thing likes chocolate. Let's see if that works. How are you supposed to knock this goddamn... Are you supposed to like shoot it from here? Uh, pretty much the point of the game is... You come to this area, this island, and you find all of its inhabitants left the town because you're trying to find pretty much like their main catcher. Hey, what am I? What am I catching on to? And uh, the point is to bring everyone back into town to try and find info on where the person went. I think I need this last person for like two more people. I have no idea how to catch this thing. Okay, I'm gonna look this up. I've given up. What the hell is this thing called? Not even the right area. Oh, there's another one over here. Apparently, this will do it. So, the other one's impossible to catch. I'm playing on a uh, PS5. There it goes. Don't fall in the fire. <laughs> I'm in fire. Oh, no. Yeah, he's on fire. Please go out. Please go out. 
me and the banana are on fire. Please go out. Okay. Well, that's not a great spot. But I guess I'll have to do. Come back this way. I'll give you chocolate. I don't know why it says it loves chocolate when it doesn't even care. There it goes. Gotcha. Alright, uh... Good riddance. Hi. Oh. Okay, can you guys get out of my face? Yeah, this game's very weird. Hence the popsicles that chase you and freeze you. I'd say... There's one, uh... These things are like Pokemon, they just say their names over and over again. You can find a burger that has like french fry legs, it's called a bunger. It's got the best voice, it goes like, bunga 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 bunga. Uh, so then pretty much you have to, you can feed them whatever you have. And then their body parts turn into that. Excellent. That is one more thing I must do. Hand me the snack. They do look like butt cheeks. The old snacktivator was worthless scrap. I have updated it. It is now capable of altering snack matter through a process of sonic anamnesis. Ugh. My body remembers what I eat. The snacktivator can change snackified limbs into anything I've ever eaten. Use it. Change my arm from Bonapa to Strabby. Okay. Are you amazed? You see nothing yet. If my hypothesis is correct, the bug snacks can remember the shape of my body. It is time to test that hypothesis. Use the snacktivator on my missing leg. What's it gonna return it to? Okay. Oh, you want it in a strappy. Aha! Uh -huh. My leg is back. Bug snacks can cure the sick, revitalize the frail. This discovery will reshape the world. Now, wait till we see the more people in town. Elizabeth and Agabel walked away from that. They got some crazy ass teeth. Pathetic. <clears throat> but I refuse to dwell on personal matters while there is yet more work to do. Use the snack activator again. Transform my limbs into cocomites. What the hell's a cocomite? Where was I? Uh, I bought some soda. Unbelievable. I gotta find Kokomite. Uh, grape Skeeto. At some point in this game, there, there was one guy who wanted like just crazy amount of snacks. At some point, I turned his teeth into Oreos. <laughs> Flame and cheap poof. Doodler. What is a Kokomite? Have I seen those? Oh, goddamn. Oh yeah, this is the bunger. This is like the Pokédex. This is the bunger. It's got the best voice. And it chases after you. Uh... And then the weenie one. What is it? Choco thing? Probably something in the area. Maybe something in. Maybe something at nighttime? Sometimes stuff comes out at different times of the day. You got a bed in here I can use? The hell was that? Not sure, be.
Hi. Uh, Tokamite. Here's the Sherby. How do I catch you? Whoa. Really? Hey, come back. What do you like? You like chocolate? I got some for you. Oh, wait, what? What happened? He's crying. Got it. What is going on over here? They're fighting. Are you the Coco thing? No, you're the creeps keto. Where the? What's a Coco mite? Hiding in here. New, new You're making a minecart rail in Minecraft that goes ten thousand blocks away from spawn. God damn. How far? Well, ten thousand blocks far away. Probably like what, a three minute ride? And I'm back out here. God damn it, what's a coca mite? I have to look this up too. Oh. <laughs> Found it. Uh it's like a powerful force. Okay, can you stop? About to blow it. Oh. <laughs> this is all working out perfectly. <laughs> yeah, also these things break apart. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna need one of you to break this for me. Maybe I need the... Oh, it worked. Uh, what? They're just ice cubes. Okay, can you go away? Shoo. Oh. Hi. They're coming after me. Run! So how do I catch you guys? Uh, okay. They love chocolate. Chocolate! Okay, didn't work. Probably gotta... Probably get them to fight these guys. Who wants to fight? I think I set one of them on fire. Oops. Uh. Yeah, they do look like turtles. Whoa. What just happened? Okay, can you hit this one, please? Get him, get him, get him. Oh, oh, God, you just freeze, that's right. I need to cool you off. Okay, that worked. Please hit this one. He's chasing me, he's all yours. God damn, that one's in the water. Do I have Discord? I do, but I don't really use it that much. You're frozen again! God dang it. Okay, I need to get you out of there. Will this even work? Got the grapple. <laughs> Wait, what was that? Okay. Where'd that go? What if I can use this? Oh! Gotcha! 
Finally. Okay, how do I get this one out of the water? That works. What? Uh, where'd he go? Oh, man. Or at least I know what these things are. There's more. All right, thanks, Anthony. Have a good night. Oh, you can just pull these. out there. Oh, he's knocked each other out. Oh, wait, do I even need you? Hang on. Uh, I got to feed one to you. Let's give you a nice nose. Uh... Come on, go, go. Yes. Mm. My body has changed into more cogamites than I've eaten. Can you even so comprehend one. Okay. what has happened? This means that all bug snacks are one and the same. Each one could change into any other with the right stimulus. And now that is true of me. Now, use the snack activator to its full potential. I want limbs of Noodler, Cocomite, Bonopper, and Strabby all at once. <laughs> I don't even have a Noodler. Okay. Well, I can help you out with two of those. Let's give you a Banopper hand. A strabby arm. Now I gotta go catch a Noodler. What are you guys doing over here? I don't know how to catch it. I saw trouble catching things that are on fire. It loves cheese. If I get them to leave for long enough. Uh, hot sauce? That the other one? That works. Halfway there. <laughs> that means I've only caught in half the bug snacks in this game. They're going crazy. Okay. Uh, I don't give you a noodle. Give you noodle teeth. <laughs> I have learned much. Despite your general ignorance, you have been of use to me. Turn into a vampire. <laughs> They're poking no her eyes. how many bug snacks I become, my body feels no different. Is there a threshold of grumpusness? When every cell of my body is bug snacks, will I remain floofy fizzle bean? Or will I simply be bug snacks right down to the taste? I must find out. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. The answers won't come to me without further testing. However, I have exhausted my research here. I will experiment on Snacksburg. You mean in Snacksburg? <laughs> I look forward to working with you further. Is that a yes? Okay. Okay. 
interview, then go to Eggabelle, and then we'll find out what to do after that. I'm actually surprised I only had to look up a one thing, which was how to catch a goddamn banana f jumping between trees. How did I catch the other one? I don't think it was a banana. I think it was a corn on the cup. How did I catch it? I just gotta try and throw something at it and eventually got it. Okay, where is this uh, floofty at? Floofty, Snoppington. I have a science buddies. Live it back into town. Maybe Don't not you buddies. Have a grumpy, naughty scheme. I'm not participating in your delusions, brother. You waste your talented mind playing spy games when you could be assisting my research. I'm never assisting you again. Not until you find your moral compass and stop working for the man. Oh, please. Don't try to dress up your cowardice. I'm no coward. I. You still haven't told the green meathead how you feel. But whether that's different, don't try to confuse the issue. Oh, I Chandler. So. I was thinking Tiffany. It's like she's married. Okay, interview. I am not here to spew gossip for that obnoxious rag you call a newspaper. Please. Very well. If you insist, I will educate you. So now, if I want to, I can change, like, anybody's, uh, limbs and stuff. Alright, I'm back. Uh, my brother came in asking if he wants to get us food. I agree, because I'm hungry. So, we ordered something. Okay, who are you? I am Floofty Frizzlebean, the world's first gastroentomologist. It's a big word. What is it? In baby language, I study bug snacks and their effect on grumpuses. Okay, why'd you come to the island? To study bug snacks, obviously. I should have guessed. We didn't know that what bug snacks were until you got here. <sighs> when Elizabeth Megafig was recruiting for her cult of personality, I observed something strange about her arm. She was keeping it hidden, but she displayed early stages of snackification. That piqued my interest. Alright, what are your thoughts? You are asking for opinions instead of facts. I'm not going to discuss my feelings with you, you emotional parasite. Okay then. Emotional parasite? Every time I try to publish my groundbreaking research, you journalists instead churn out slander about my dangerous methods or my questionable behavior. Stop editorializing and focus on the science. Alright, so why'd you leave town? I simply wanted to continue my work, Agabel or no, but Shelda blamed me for the disappearances. I'm no stranger to witch hunts. I vacated before the pitchforks could come out. Is it true that you eat grumpuses? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I've only eaten one grumpus. What? Who? Oh. You're not gonna follow up on that? Uh, why is there a severed leg in your hut? Would you prefer I keep my severed leg in the outhouse? Yeah, you saw. She had her severed leg. Uh, any info? The truth. <laughs> Elizabeth was an arrogant coward, unlike Egabel. What about Egabel? Egabel truly understood my research. She was hungry to participate in it. Our work together was fruitful, even pleasant, until somebody interfered. Who? Shelda. That mummified fraud stoked Elizabeth's fear of my work, weaponizing her relationship to Egabel. Scrambling her fragile emotions and fabricating a binary choice between myself and Elizabeth. So what happened? Ultimately, Agabel chose sentiment over science. And I surmise that was the death of her. Well, she ain't dead. Yes. I have the password to Agabel's personal storage box. Ooh. It may be of interest to you. That's not a password, that's a key. Of my time now. Leave. Talking about bug snacks. What the hell does that mean? I'll interview every Grumpus. So I can't interview Eggabel? So many skulls. Hi. Yeah. How's it going? How you doing, dog? Okay. 
take to a video diary number five. Why are there eyeballs everywhere? <laughs> or googly eyes. Alright, this might be the last one. That's what I'm wondering. Do your muscles carry into the bug snacks? Like Chandler, oh, he's a ripped guy, but if he eats a french fry, is it going to be a little thing or a big thing? Documentarian. I'm guessing read all the documents. Okay, got all the notes, got all the interviews, all the video files. Let's get returned to Egabel. And possibly find Lisbert. What a weird name. Lisbert. It's like why is there why is it a mix between Elizabeth and like Herbert? Or like What name ends in Bert? I guess Herbert? Is that a name? around here wait did you go around this way oh, crap did I go this way where am I creamy patch this melty pile of cream and cook Ooh. Why would you say cream and cookie? It's cookie and cream. There's something at nighttime. Okay, what is this? You're just, you're just telling me to jump. Did that kill me or did that send me back down? Okay. Wait, did I just go around? Oh, I, t I went around the mountain. Where the hell's Lisbert? Or not Lisbert, uh, Egabelle. Is she down here? There you are. No, not, not the campfire. Mr. Snowman. Oh, it looks like Lisbert. Oh no. Egabelle's igloo. <laughs> Thus, igloo. I'll just plug this controller in. Okay. Uh. I have the journal. Oh, my grump. Where'd you find this? Good work. Was her writing always this sloppy? It's not doctor bad, but still. Huh. Says I'll need to activate these statues by feeding them the snack they represent. <sighs> Thanks for the help. I'll take it from here. 
Uh, you don't need this alone. Fine. If you catch half, I'll catch the other half, and we'll meet back here. Sound good? Good. Well, which half? Does it matter? I can't even tell what this is. Oh, that's a cookies and cream one, probably. Are these ones all around here? Yeah, they gotta be. Uh, I don't have any on me, do I? No, I think these are from the other area. Alright, time to do some catching. I am not... Actually, I probably could catch that one. Was it in... <laughs> it likes peanut butter, okay. And fire sauce? Where do I get fire sauce? I've been everywhere. I got hot sauce. Are you one? I'll catch you anyway. Uh, ah, ball sack. I can use the sodi to get the to uh, get the the fire thing out. Hopefully the soda counts as one. What was that? Oh yeah, Instabug. What's that? You want to? You want me to like, subscribe, and eat you? So wait, can you do both these at the same time? Oh, I got it. Oh wait, where's the sodi? Ah. Okay, well, let's see if the Sodi even actually is one of them. Definitely not that. What is this? Is that the Sodi? That looks like a bottle cap. Let's try it. Think that worked? That looks like a cookie mouse. No, that's the cookie mouse. What is the Instabug? Uh, no, that's definitely the one flying around. Are you the Instabug? No, you got spoons on you. You're like a cookie. It's gotta be this one. Oh, what? Oh, it didn't take it away from me. Might as well try all of them. So you have the soda as one of them, but not the bug? Really? Okay. I guess I'll go find the chocolate chip cookie. Oh, wait. Um. I sleep. Will that respawn the bugs? Okay, it does. You definitely use that to get... Where'd it go? What is that? There's an egg in there. Oh, you love hot sauce. Can't believe that worked. 
Hey, can you break this? Scoop, 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 scoop. Scoop, scoop, scoop it on Yuppie, scoop it on Yuppie. Scoop, scoop. Oh, it worked. Okay, now get out of here. No, not the egg. Or is that just another egglet? My trap. Oh, just another eggler. Yeah, I don't think I need you. Uh, oh wait, what am I doing? I can bring that to my hot sauce. Try and bring that thing down to the water. That's peanut butter. Uh, hopefully I have enough. Okay. Oh, okay, I should probably just... Maybe I can use the launch pad. For there, at least. Bring it down there? Hopefully you're the only one that likes hot sauce. Now we just wait. Don't want to waste all my hot sauce. Why are there six spoons? I guess uh, that note was true. If you turn it upside down, it does not come out. All right, which one's the Stoodler? So you? Yep. One more. I'm gonna wait until my time for that one, even though I don't know what it is. What is this? It's like a chocolate chip thing. Are you the thing that keeps hitting me and you're the flying thing? Let's see if I can get the flying thing. God, it's so high up. Flutter jam. Peanut butter and fire. Not enough peanut butter. Oh wait, when it says fire, does it mean like there's not like a fire sauce, but it's like just in fire? <gasps> wait, you're the cookie. Chippy. Please don't fall, please don't fall. Okay. That didn't work. I can trip it. Shoot. Please don't fall. Okay. Will this work? Oh, I didn't even I didn't even need the trap. All right, we got it all. Jump. Shortcut. Okay, hopefully you had fun with the other You're three. Okay. You are okay, right? No drowsiness, numbness, or missing limbs? 
Uh, sorry. Not right now. <laughs> uh, don't mind me. I got the rest of the snacks. You didn't even know what three I was getting. Okay. Next she says... Oh. She says we need three Grumpuses to do the final step. No. This mountain is unstable. The more of us there are stomping around up here, the more likely it is we'll cause a disaster. Just one Never more. anybody else get hurt for my sake. I feel bad enough involving you. Uh, it's not just for your sake. Oh, what would Lisbert do? She would man up. Ask Philbo. Liz trusts Philbo for some reason. I'll wait for you here. Watch your step on the way back down, okay? I was gonna suggest we just use the snowman. <laughs> It's roughly the same size. Shouldn't that work? What's this? No. Oh. Retrieve all that. Okay, Philbo. The man who I first met. He's gonna help us out now. He's gonna finally do something. Philbo. What's going on? How's nice to see ya? You need your help. With what? Uh, there's a mystery. <gasps> really? Oh, buddy, say no more. I am there. Okay, thank you. You could have just, you know, spawned me down there too, but that's all right. As long as you spawn me back up. This is a, this is, this is a big mountain, huh? A lot of, oh, a lot of steps. Come on, you got carrot legs, you're fine. Oh, grump, I knew this was a bad idea. Oh, no, I'm fine, really. Oh, hey, you look just like my friend Agabel. Agabel! Oh, it's really you! Oh, you're here, alive, and not dead! Yes, it's me, Philbo. Calm down, you'll hyperventilate. Huh? Oh, okay, okay, uh, yeah. Um, oh. Are you coming back to Snacksburg? Come on, get up. Let's get this door open before altitude sickness kicks in. Oh, Agabel, it's so I good to run. see you. I can't believe you've been up here all this time. You're so, uh, different. That's right. The soft little Agabel you knew is gone. Yeah, you, you really could kick out her out legs so shell, easily huh? with that. <laughs> hey, um, so. Why do you want my help? I thought you would have asked Chandlo. Chandlo's got Snorpy to worry about. Besides, you've been following Liz around for years. What? I don't follow her around? Uh-huh. Point is, I know you care. And since I need three grumps, you might as well be one of them. Whoa, what is that thing? Liz thought it might be some kind of ancient temple to bug snacks. Oh, uh, wait a minute. If this door takes three of us to open, how would Lisbert get inside by herself? What makes you think she's behind it? Because she has to be. I looked everywhere else. Well, it, it definitely looks important. How do we, uh, get in? Right. We need to stand here, here, and here. On three, we push. Hmm. Oh. This is it. Ready? One, two, three. Did you do it in the wrong order? I could have killed us all. What did I do wrong? Hey, hey, it's okay, Agabel. That was kind of scary, but we're fine. We'll just try it again and... No, I'll try it again. You two are going home. Egabel, I want to find Lisbert just as badly as you do. You don't have to do this alone. Yes, I do. I'm a burden to everybody around me. That's why she's gone. W what do you mean? 
I was being stupid, and I slipped up on the cliffs while I was trying to show off. The earthquake hit, and, and I was going to fall, but Liz saved me, like she always does. She got swept away, and then the ground opened beneath her, and it, it swallowed her up. I'm so sorry, Agabelle. Don't be. I'm used to it. Please, just go. I can't stand to see anyone else hurt. <laughs> you know, when I was looking for Lisbert, I got really hungry. I, I couldn't catch bug snacks, so I tried eating this purple flower, but then I threw up. And then I went blind for a bit, and then I fell in a hole. And, and by the time I dragged myself out of there, I, I was so tired. That's what this guy was doing before I found him. <laughs> that's when we met, buddy. Ilpo, th that's awful. <laughs> it was. Because, you know, I, I can't make it on my own like you and Lisbert. And it's times like those when I could really use a doctor. <laughs> All right. I get it. I need some time to think. I still want to figure out what I got wrong. When I do, I'll come find you. And then we'll find Liz together. Thank you, Philbo. Stay safe. No, thy neighbor. Oh, she going back? You just found new hope if you tripped. <laughs> oh man. I mean, okay, I found everyone. Everyone's back. I gotta go back into town. What is that thing? Chilly nilly. <laughs> freezing and flying. <laughs> flying and freezing cold. <laughs> Thawing it might bring it down. I've tried to hug one, but it gave me the cold shoulder. Alright, this thing wins. What was that? Oh. So... So is Lizbird still alive? She got sucked into a hole. <laughs> Philbo wants to talk to you. I have to interview... Think about the way. No? I'll be back in one sec. Okay, I'm back. Uh, Philbo. Here's to a hard day. Wow, it's getting crowded around here. I can't believe it. We gotta celebrate big time. This party's gonna change everything, buddy. Are you sure you're ready? Once you start the party, you won't be able to catch bug snacks or complete quests. Be sure you've done everything you want to before continuing. Uh, the side quests and stuff, I'm sure, are great and fun. I just kind of want to finish the campaign because I don't really want to stream this again. At least for like another few hours. I'm close, so let's just do it. This is awesome! But it'll be even more awesome once everybody's on the dance floor! I got half of the bug snacks. I only need help with one to how to catch. I call that a win. Snack water! Get your snack water here! Fresh, organic, cruelty light! What are you kidding? Hey, there's business to be done here. I'm not leaving this stand till I get some of these grumps to loosen up. Oh, I'll drink some. Apology, brother. They're My siblings? Insults were unnecessary. Your inventions are quite valuable in capturing research samples, and I appreciate that about you. Your apology is as lacking as your ethical standards, but it's a start. Excellent. Now that we are reconciled, I have a dozen research papers that could use peer review. 
As you seem to have free time right now, let us begin. And I take it all back. No, no, you go dance. You're interrupting personal business. Unless you have something intelligent to say, be gone. Rhythmic gyration has no purpose. Be at ease. The party lights double as a wave inhibitor. This party is secure. Okay. I have something important to ask Chandler, but such an annoying sibling of mine won't leave me be. Rhythmic gyration has... How do I get these people to go dance? I was worried at first, but this party's kind of nice. Even the little ones are having fun. <laughs> we'll make a party animal out of you yet, darling. Now let's work on your dance moves. Never seen everybody getting so rowdy before. Usually that means something bad's about to happen. I don't know. I remember the last party. As long as Wambus is around, I can't let my guard down. What a <sighs> fabulous party. It's no Grumpapalooza, but we make do. My darling, I'm always dancing. I'd love to storm the dance floor, but I prefer to sing along. And tragically, my vocal cords are fried. Go drink something. How do I get her to drink? Here. Wow. Oh. At last, beverage service. Now I can sing the night away. That's one. Ah. Ooh, that feels good. What are you kidding? That is business to be done in. Oh, you need multiple. Oh, you see that? Busting a move. So the osteoblast says, looks like the two of us are really boned. <laughs> <laughs> really boned. <laughs> yeah, Trippy, you're such a treasure. You want to go I dance? I find shindig we got here. Better than the last one, that's for sure. I'm thinking I should apologize to Gramble first. But I can't muster up the words. Maybe I could use some of that there uh, liquid courage. Okay. Oh, How do you hold up with a french fry? Much obliged, stranger. I better talk to Gramble before I lose my nerve. Am I really a stranger at this point? You want to dance? This party's a real hoot. Oh, gosh, I don't know. I got two left feet. Wouldn't you rather hear about the captivating history of dance? No. I mean, technically, you have one left, or one right foot and one uh, ribeye foot. Hey, now, I don't want any trouble, Wambus. Gramble, I'm sorry. I've been rude to you and even worse to your little one. You, you're serious? No fooling? I don't tell jokes, Gramble. I am not creative. Oh, apology accepted. Of course, no forgiving is complete without a hug. No, but I suppose a dance couldn't hurt. All right, that's two more. Come on, your husband's dancing. Get in on it. Oh gosh, I don't. Wait, what was that? I bet Floofty will want to learn all about the Desert Empire's dance of certain death. Oh, you see that? Bust in a move. So you see, the desert dance mirrors the moves for hand-to-hand -hand combat against bug snacks. Thus, the youth were tricked into learning. Fascinating. Hiding purpose and frivolous waste. I will make use of this principle. Oh, you believe it when she says it. Trippany has convinced me of the historic and cultural value of expressive movement. Perhaps I should experiment. Phew, I'm all talked out. Makes me want to shake my tailbone. All right, two more. Go talk to, uh, I want to the guy. Chandler how I feel, but he seems busy taking advice from that ridiculous hippie. Okay, I'll go deal with her. Watch my move. One who is me has foreseen the path to enlightenment is not walked with the feet. It is a journey taken with the mind. 
I understand your wisdom, oh great Shelda. You're saying I should chug this snack water upside down, dog! Yes! Huh. <laughs> okay. If I knew we were throwing parties like this, I'd have come back weeks ago. Maybe later, bro. I'm busy soaking up Shelda's wisdom. All right, gotta get rid of her. Rain of venom. A wellspring of sorrows. Go dance. An ore plead. A snow of paper shards. So this must be before one dances. What? Right, you too. How's the party treating you, Beth? Hmm, you've seen worse. Yeah, it's really coming together. It's nice to see everybody getting along. <sighs> Listen, Bilbo, I appreciate what you're doing, like getting everybody here. It's way less boring now. But these grumps aren't friends. They're just making nice because it's better than being alone. Sure, but who wants to be alone? <laughs> <laughs> you're such a squeeb, but like in a good way. Aw, thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the dance floor. Hope I see you there. That's one more. I give this party seven out of ten, which is pretty good, I guess. For Philbo. Go Me? dance. Dance? I don't think this party could handle it. Besides, this isn't really my song. Can I change it? Woohoo! Is this your song? Me dance besides this. Hmm. How about this? Me dance besides this. Hmm. How many songs are there? Yeah. How about this one? Sounds pretty good. OMG, they're playing my song. Yes. I'm gonna show them what a real party looks like. All right, four more. These two. Oh, just these guys. Can I get her a drink? Ah, right, that's enough work. Okay. Now it's time to work the dance floor. I didn't think they ain't one don't day. How do I get you out of here? Oh, oh, oh! Hopefully. A heart enraptured is mine. So it is! <laughs> One tears up the dance floor. Boogie boogie! Okay. You go talk with your guy. Oh, my chance has arrived. Don't blow it, Fizzlebean. <clears throat> Chandlo, I, I, we've been together for so long, and I've always wondered how you feel about me. Do, do you want to be my boyfriend? What? Bro, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, I see. Y yes, never mind. F forget what I said. Snorpy, we've been dating for years. W wait, what? How is that possible? Dude, remember that time we made out on that Ferris wheel and I said we should move in together? Uh, well, well, yes, I, I just thought that we were roommates <coughs> with Benavis. You know I hate ambiguity. Sorry, Snorp Dog. Is that clear? Why are you showing me his that? ass? <laughs> I love you, dog. Now let's dance! Okay. Who is in here? There's two people not here. Eggabo? Yeah! Not just Eggabo. Oh. <laughs> How'd you get up there? Watch my moves. It's as good as my singing. Ooh. 
We did it, buddy. We're all together again. Well, almost all of us. But you know what? Knowing Agabella's Someone just run up on us? We hope that Lisbeth is out there, too. I mean, none of this would have been possible without you, buddy. I know you have to go back for your job eventually, but... I'd sure miss you if you left. And, well, you still need to interview Lisper, right? So... Our end is nigh. No, it's you. What? End? Well, is, is that a metaphor, or...? Another earthquake? Gotta move! Now! The quake. Are, are you okay, buddy? All right. I, I know this looks bad, but... As long as we keep calm, our doom approaches. Pray to your gods, children. It's the queen of bug snacks. She's rising from the depths to devour us all. The Grumpanati aim to silence us for good. Their machinations are coming to fruition. Now, hold on. We're not going to die because of some cult or monster. That's right. We're going to die because the volcano's going off. There's a volcano? That's right. Wait, what? Oh, bad timing. Suppose we're gonna end up buried like all the others, eh? Come on, bro. We can survive this. As long as we got bug snacks, we'll be fine. I don't know if there's any bug snacks that are lava proof. Escaped. Bummer. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're homeless and out of bug snacks? Oh, it's a grumpy grump world now. <laughs> uh, dibs on eating Philbo. Please do. I'm quite curious to see the result. Will Befica turn into Philbo or the bug snacks he's eaten? Hold on a moment while I retrieve my notes. Hey, 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 don't give up yet. We may not have homes or snacks, but we have each other. I know it's pretty scary right now, but we can't fall apart every single time something bad happens. We have to stick together. Well said, Philbo. Egabro! Egabro! You're all right! <laughs> What a pleasant surprise. Welcome back, Dr. Batanugget. Hey, everybody. Chanlo, Floofty, Mr. Troubleham. Doc? I'm glad you made it. Does that mean you figured it out? That's right, Philbo. We know how to get to Liz. That's amazing! We gotta go right away! Ooh, sorry to say it, but is now really the best time? This might be the only chance we get. Liz is in danger, and this disaster is only getting started. The worst is yet to come. So spills forth the toxin unending. Quiet, you. Doctor, you are only subjecting yourself to needless risk. Elizabeth is likely deceased. Dog, this bird is alive. And we're not going to leave her behind. I just need Philbo and, uh, Philbo's buddy. Sorry, Chandler. Well, what are the rest of us supposed to do while y'all were gone? You prepare for the worst. What do we need right now? Well, I'm sick of being in the dark for one. I want to know what's out there. No worries, Beth. I'll build a couple bonfires, maybe a watchtower. Whatever's out there, we'll see it coming. But what do we do when the queen comes to devour us? Well, I have a few prototype traps that I could put to use. How about the more practical threats? You know, the earthquakes, the volcanoes, and what have you. Simple. We find a way to get off the ground if the need arises. Well, none of that matters if I starve to death. We got my sauce. <laughs> no way, pal. I ain't gonna chat out on that nasty plant goop. <clears throat> I stand corrected. No more concerns? Great. Let's get to it then. Okay. Open the mysterious mountain door. I'll beat you guys there. Okay, why is it called the hunt? We're we hunting Elizabeth or uh Lisbert. Yeah, it looks fine up here. Maybe we should move up here. Hey Agibo, after we get Lisbert, are you two gonna come back to town? Oh, I don't know. I'm starting to like sleeping on freezing cold rocks. Where's your eye patch? But I'm sure Liz misses our bed. Well, it'll be ready for you. I've been keeping your hut clean for whenever you got back. <laughs> You're such a weird guy, Philbo. All right, meet you guys there. I'm 
I'm not, I don't know much about science, but shouldn't this part be shaken just as much? Mountain. Still. Tall. Oh, do you need a break? Uh, how about water? Let me check your vitals. No, no, I'm okay. Besides, we're, we're almost there. Right? Right. But in the future, you could stand to do some exercise or, or just hang out with Chandlo. Well, will just standing next to him make you better? All right, we're here. Um, how do we get this thing open, Egabel? Turns out she wrote the order backwards. I guess even the great Elizabeth Megafig can still make mistakes. Well, nobody's nerfigged, right? <laughs> How'd you okay, know it was backwards? I don't remember. What, what was it? Uh, first left, then right, then center. So center first. We're coming, Liz. One, two, three. Me first. Nailed it. Oh boy. The under snacks? Oh, I'm by myself. What is all this? Crutches? Okay. Queen. She lives. Ah, what is this thing? Help! I'm coming, Philbo. Get away from him. Oh, oh thanks, buddy. Uh, is Egabo with you? I don't know how we all got separated. Well, you found me pretty quick. I'm sure she's not far. So are we inside yeah, something? What is this stuff? Ugh, it's slimy and cold, and I, uh, I, uh, I kind of want to eat it. Uh, if Lizbert is really down here, we better find her fast. Are we inside like intestines, like a digestive tract. Hey, Elizabeth. Oh, Elizabeth, it's you. You're alive. <laughs> Bilbo, you're here. I, 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 I can't believe it. We've got so much catching up to do. I, I wish I could, but we're out of time. You have to get out of here. You have to gather up the others and get off the island. Oh, okay. She like. Then we can talk Full on, on bug snacks? No, Bilbo. I can't go with you like this. I'm so sorry. Are you seriously trying to interview me right now? I mean, you called me here. I regret inviting you. You came here to interview Elizabeth <laughs> Megafig? Fine. Keep it quick. Where is this place? This? This is the island's true form. It's bug snacks all the way down. That's kind of amazing. It's disgusting. Once you understand what bug snacks really are. What are bug snacks? They're parasites. They get inside you and they change you, your body and your mind. They make you want them. And before you know it, you become them. Who would want to turn into bug snacks? It's not that simple. They're insidious. Patient. You'll show them a weakness, and they'll exploit it. What you see here, this is what's left of everybody who came before us. 
of every living thing that wasn't bug snacks. They always win. All right, what happened to you? After I saved Egabel, I fell into this place. Before I knew what was happening, I was swarmed. Bug snacks were crawling down my throat. They tried to erase me, to make me into them. That's horrible. I almost lost myself, but somehow I pushed back. I made them into me. Okay, so that bug stack golem monster was you? That's right. I'm sorry if I scared you. I just wanted to make everyone leave this awful place. But I can't make bug snacks talk. So the bug snacks are under control. <sighs> no. The bug snacks are in a frenzy. They have been since we came here. They're so ravenous that they're shaking the ground apart. I'm the only thing keeping this island together right now. But it's like fighting a tsunami with a bucket. Okay, it's everything. There. You have your answers. I hope you write a story worth telling. I'm sorry that I put you through so much to get it. I can't hold them back for much longer. Please, go and warn the others. Wait, I, I have one more question. If you're really not coming back, then... Then... What am I supposed to do without you? What do you mean? You've been doing just fine without me. It's only a matter of time before I screw up and ruin everything. I I'm not good at stuff, and everybody hates me. But you... They love you, Lisbert. <laughs> they love the idea. She keeps changing. Okay. I'm sorry I put so much on your shoulders, Bilbo. But you... You are the one who can bring them together. Me? Well, I'm the one who made it all fall apart. What are you saying? I led you to this terrible island. I filled your bodies with parasites. I ignored all the warning signs. I didn't understand what any of you really needed. So now I'm taking responsibility for my mistakes. I'll keep the bug snacks at bay long enough for everyone to escape. Liz, no, 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 there has to be some other way we can help you. No, I should be the only one to suffer the consequences of my actions. Nobody else needs to get hurt because of me. Oh, hey, Eye Patch is Where back. Where have I heard that before? Acabil, you shouldn't be here. You need to get away. Get up, get up. Come on, let's go, get up. Hey! Uh, ow! Oh, Egabil, stop it! No, you stop it! I didn't sleep in an igloo for months just so you could play martyr! We're getting out of here together! Uh, I... I can't! My control is already slipping. If I step outside this cave, my connection to the bug snacks will break and the island will collapse before I make it another step! Huh. All right, then I'll get in there with you. Move over. Move over? It's not a car, Bill. I'm stuck. What? See? That wasn't so hard, right? It worked! Eggabill, you beautiful genius! <laughs> Wait, how did you lose your eye? Oh, I didn't. I just got conjunctivitis. At least the eye patch looks cool, right? Hmm. It does make you look a bit dangerous. So, um, how long before the island explodes? Oh, <clears throat> I don't know. It could be any moment. But I'm sure Liz and I can keep it together at least until you get everybody out of here. What? So now I'm supposed to leave both of you behind? Hey, don't worry about us. We've been through worse than this, right? We I mean, both this is death. So much by ourselves. Imagine what we can do when we're together. Okay. Good luck. And I'll see you again someday. It's time to get moving. Get back to Snacksburg. You're going to have to take a bit of a shortcut. Hold on. What just happened?
Well, okay. I still got some bugs. Run, Strawby. Oh, hey, we've been here before. Uh, Agabo? Is that you? Oh, sorry, buddy. Head hurt. Oh, bad. Not dream time yet. Gotta save friends. Yes! Yes, save friends! Uh, it's been so long since I've been here. I don't remember how to get back. Is that pineapple? Oh, is the island turning into like a literal food? Yep. We've got to get back to Snagsburg as fast as we can. We can't let the others eat any more bug snacks. If they transform all the way, then, then, then who knows what'll happen? I mean, how long have you guys been eating bug snacks? Just until we're all out of here. Have you guys been eating bug snacks the entire time? Yet yeah, when I got here, all of you had normal limbs. Hi, right, did you get my thing working? Snorpy! There they are. Where in Grump's name have you two been? I'll explain later. The bug snacks are coming to wipe us out. We gotta get off this island now! I suspected as much. Luckily, the balloon is almost ready to take flight. Great! But where is everybody? They're, <laughs> They're fighting the snacks. I've supplied them with all my most dangerous inventions. That'll only buy us time. Snort Dog! They're coming down from the mountain! I need you here! Now! Hold steady, my love. I'm on my way. Oh, but somebody needs to finish fueling the balloon. Don't worry, Snorpy. Leave the balloon to me. Go and help Chandlo. Splendid. As for you, you may need my snack chop. It's much like the snack trap if it were set to... Uh, puree. Good luck. I'm gonna go kill some bugs. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Never mind. Buddy, you better put that trap to good use. I mean, it's just... Strawbies. Oh. Okay, now I'm just murdering the bug snacks. Oh, okay. I'll be fine for now, buddy. Go and help the others. I'll have the balloon ready by the time you get back. Oh my god, am I just gonna like go murder all the bug snacks? Stay still, you pugnacious pest! God, why did Snorberton make this so cumbersome? One has foreseen. The bug snacks will be five feet to the right of where you're aiming. I'm a scientist, not an exterminator. You do it if you're so inclined. One is strictly a pacifist. Also, one is pushing 70. I was watching murder two ah, bug snacks. But here comes someone with a healthy capacity for violence. Take this device and clear a path for us, please. What is this? A punching bug? Punching glove? What does this game turn into? In the final act, too. They aren't even doing anything, they're just looking at us. Okay, these guys might be dangerous. Oh god. Well, I thought I killed everyone. We're still here. Is there one hiding in here? Oh. That's enough mortal danger for one day. Let's abscond while the bug snacks have subsided. You don't have to tell me twice. You, however, must continue. The others still need your help. Alright, help Chanlo and Snorpy. Come on, snacks! Let's see what you got! 
Uh, Chum, over here. I've just finished another device, the Trip Drone. With this, we can hold off the bug snacks and escape before Chandlo collapses. Don't worry, Snort Dog. I could do this all day. <sighs> oh, you beautiful fool. I'll pilot the drone. You aim the shot. Fortunately, we're short on connective surfaces. How about this? Helly oop! Uh, okay. That's you. Three points. This is pretty easy enough. You just wait for them to kill themselves. Nothing but law. Let's get another angle. Relocating. You got this. Man, what an bro. epic final battle. Oh, did I miss them? Okay, they just ate them. Oh, shit. Did I miss him? I did. We crushed it, dog. I'm gonna give you the hug of your life. Don't no. celebrate too soon. We're not safe until we're off this horrid rock. To the balloon. Okay, who else needs help? Befka and Kamado. Krom Kramdo? This smoke is making my eyes water. Don't worry. There's one thing I'm good at. It's looking for trouble. <sighs> Speaking up, snacks at three o'clock. You what smoke? It. Fire in the hole. Whoa, that toast. Who knew snack water was so flammable, huh? It's almost a shame to waste it like this. Oh, bestie, you're just in time for the end of the world. But. But now that you're here, if you take over the lunch pad, Cromdo can pick up the speed on those barrels. Can't you, Cromdo? Eh, sure thing, Beth. If I don't break my crumpet back first. Okay. How'd I miss that? Let's do this if they can just eat them. How much is left? Still got Wambus and probably his wife. Run away, snacks. Never come back. How do you feel with all this scramble? We're killing all the bug snacks. I don't get it. Why are the little ones attacking us? They love me. They're like a mob of adoring fans, darling. They love you so much that they they each want a piece of you. Even so, I can't bring myself to to hurt them. 
So why'd Snorpy have to go and weaponize Sprout? Ramble! I didn't know you were so punk rock. I'm not a punk or a rock! I... I can't do this! Well, I know who can. Darling, I've got them all warmed up. It's time for you to bring the house down! Okay. Oh, look at you, you're eating them. We'll say, for like the final, you know, thing, this really isn't that fun. <laughs> Okay, Wampus and Trifony, are you the last Come on ones? Now. Get, get, get your varmints! It's no use, Wambi. Must have learned a few things since the Stone Age. <laughs> She's using well, the cactus. What do you want me to do? I won't let them take my garden. Your garden's There's done, man. Garden left. There's enough. I still got my special sauce, fresh grown. Oh, good thinking. What? That's not what I meant. Oh, I didn't see you there. Would you mind helping out? Just a matter of life and death is all. Special sauce. That one was easy. Are we not done yet? No, we are. Break as we're gonna get. Come on, Wambi. It's now or never. Oh, I gave it my best. All right, Trippy. Let's go home. <laughs> okay, we're done. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, we're all here. Though I think the balloon needs another minute. Survivor. What the fuck is that? Gotta get on board now. Come on, we're not gonna make it. Uh. Oh. Hi guys. <laughs> Thanks, Liz. Egg. And that's the end of Snack Tooth Island. You had to bring the cactus. Vacation's end. That was a tiny island. I could probably talk to all of you, right? Let's just talk to Philbo. Hey, buddy. Are you ready to go? Wait, can I talk to everyone? They all have a lot to say.
Well, there goes another farm. Serves me right for building it on top of an island-sized pest. <laughs> I guess there's no shame in starting fresh. I'll find a place with rich soil, and even richer history, where me and Triffy can settle down. Okay. I was so close to giving up back there. I get so caught up dwelling on the way lives end. But that's not the only thing that matters, yeah? Wambus and I, we're going to start the rest of our lives today. It's funny. I spent all my time chasing one muse. And as soon as I put it out of my mind, another strikes me. As we floated down from the sky, watching our home crumble to dust, a little song sprung into my head. I call it an ode to Gramble. I don't think Gramble likes you. I thought I'd be real sad when I left all my little ones behind. But I feel okay. I don't know. Maybe it helps they try to murder me. But also... I got folks who love me back for real. Like, well, Wiggle. Yeah, maybe he does. Oh, hey, bestie. I think I need a vacay from this vacay. Going home doesn't seem so bad anymore. And my old life, my old friends, they're all gone. But like... Now I know that I can make new friends. And this time, I won't ruin it for myself. Nah, just don't be a bitch. Okay, I know when I'm beat. I draw the line at island full of monsters. <laughs> All I wanted to do was quit my dead-end job and do what makes me happy. I don't need some big bug snack scam to do that. Hey, maybe I'll get started in the music business. Yeah, go talk to Wiggle. While I regret that all my research was destroyed, I have come away with a revelation. I cannot improve Grumpus Kind if I refuse to understand it. It may be a long and frankly annoying endeavor, but it is one worth pursuing. I've never felt so wrong being right. I wish I hadn't wasted so much time telling riddles. I don't need to be all-powerful to give good advice. I just need to be me. And those who listen, will listen. Okay. Look at that mess. It seems my enemies aren't so all-powerful after all. But still, there were many close calls. And Chandler was always there for me. I think, perhaps, I could share everything with him. Bro, that was intense. There's no way I ever would have made it out of there by myself. Good thing Snorpy had my back. When did he get so strong? Maybe I hit my personal limit. But that doesn't matter. There's no limit to what we can do together. Hey, buddy. Are you ready to go? Yep. All right, everybody. We should head out. I hate leaving it like this. Liz and Egg, what if they're still out there? We have to move on. I know. I can't go wallowing in regret now. We're barely even out of the woods. It's gonna take a while for the bug snacks to wear off on us. I can't go back home like this, so... Is it alright if I stay with you for a while? I can help you with your story. Maybe figure out which parts to tell, or... I guess I got a spare room. Alright. Let's go. That was the answer, like... I guess... Oh, you right, got you. guts. Tracking down Elizabeth inside an erupting volcano? It's compelling, dramatic, sensational. I'd call it fiction if you didn't have this Philippus Yahoo along as a witness. <laughs> it's Philbo, actually. Point is, you're a regular Grumpter S. Thompson. It's just too bad those bug snacks weren't real, huh? 
Yeah, too bad. <laughs> I, I, I hate to think that we went through all that for nothing. So, um, I hope you can spread the truth about Snack Tooth before anybody else gets hurt. Don't worry. GNN specializes in painful truths. And speaking of, you're fired. This what? story's a page turner and all, but you lost your job the second you walked out that door. That was like weeks ago. What? Oh, please. It's not like I expected you to come back. Also, you're legally dead. Might want to clear that up soon. Well. Well, that wasn't ideal, but you've had worse days, huh, buddy? So, I no. hear the elections are coming up, and, uh... I was thinking of running for mayor. I could oh, really? use a helping paw. How about it? Never would have thought you'd be a mayor. Nothing on you gives that away. Okay. <laughs> That's bug snacks. Uh... Best thing about this game is this song. Bug snacks. Who's Bronica? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who's Bronica? Don't tell me like they had a child or something. Okay. Well, this game was a game. <laughs> Uh, I thought it was very different from what I was expecting. Uh, Wiggle and Gramble. Oh, he's donating. How nice. I thought it was going to be like legit Pokemon, but with bug snacks. Like, I thought it would be like open world. Like, you just capture bug snacks. Oh, he actually is taking a music career. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, I enjoyed the game through and through, but the ending I just didn't like. Oh, Yuri Lowenthal was Chan, though? And Roger Craig Smith was Snorpy? I don't really recognize any of the names. If I see the face, I might know them. <laughs> the names for the pictures. Um. Yeah, no. Usually I rank games like out of 10 points. So let's just do that right now. Um, so if you don't know, I rank games based on 10 points of five categories each in those categories. No, of five categories based on two points each. I was right, but not because I had magical powers. Uh, and those categories are design, gameplay, story, worth the money, and the funness of it. So design, I thought the game was fine. You know, it had its own look. The fuzzy little creatures that inhabited this world and like the little weird bug snacks that would say whatever their name was. It was Pokemon, but with like bug snacks. Yeah, and its own like unique cartoony art style. The, the sounds the <laughs> bug snacks were make were great. I love the burger, 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 burger. Or was it? It was Bunger. Bunger, Bunger, Bunger. And the... There's no idea. I forget what it was, but... Oh, he won the mayor! Congrats, Philbo. Uh... Made with FMOD Studio by Firelight Technologies. I don't want to read that. Uh... Design, yeah, I'll give it to you. I enjoyed it. It looks. I like the yard style. Wait, did they survive? Huh. Uh. No, no, I sent them away. It would be hard to make them disappear at this point. Do they suspect anything? Hmm. Hard to say. Could be they're idiots. Could be they know the truth and they're keeping it quiet. Omni 
What? I'm s There's something more going on here? Okay, didn't see that gone. Um, so also, I wasn't going to do this because the credits were rolling, but since we're back at the main menu, let me just go ahead and do this. Nope, that was not right. <laughs> let me do this. This is the graphic I have for ranking. I don't know. I decided to bring it over. Uh, so yeah, design 2 out of 2. I thought it was fine. The gameplay. The gameplay... I mean, you took pictures of bug snacks and uh, that's it. <laughs> you walked around, you had unique traps. Some of them were difficult, more difficult than others. Game Boy, I'll, I'll, I'll give a one. It was all right. The traps were, you know, different variety of traps. Nothing really that crazy or unique. Uh, the story... The story, from what I can recall, this woman, Eliz or Lisbert, got a bunch of people to come live on this island that were inhabited with bug snacks. Bug snacks being these creatures you can eat, taste delicious, and you become them. You're a journalist who gets word of this. You come to investigate and interview everyone. When you get there, it turns out people are missing. <laughs> Or the person that invited you is missing, and you have to you help out bringing everyone back into town and figuring out what the hell is happening. For it to be that the girl who went missing was <laughs> became a bug snack pretty much, and you find out the island it's not like cute and fun, it's like a parasite, <laughs> and like now they're trying to kill you. What? Uh... And then the ending, that whole part, I was just like, what the fuck am I doing? Just everyone get on the boat. They're not even attacking that much. Run and stab. The story, I'll give a one. It was, all right, the bug snacks idea is cool. I don't know what the ending was, man. Worth the money? Um, How much was this? Was it 30? Because I had it on a... It was on PS Plus, which pretty much tells me that, uh, like, uh, we should be on PS Plus, you know, Let's see what happens, which might mean, you know, it's not the best. Can you just tell me the simple price? 25, 30, 25, like around 30 bucks. That's not too bad. Uh. I mean, I didn't really encounter any bugs or anything. Well, I did encounter bugs, but not like <laughs> glitches or anything. No game crashes. It's like a 10-hour experience. You can get either get it for free. Or how long was it? I did it for like seven hours. If you play, continue the rest of the campaign, you probably had like another five hours. If you want to go collect all the bug snacks, that'll probably be a couple more. Eh, worth the money, I'll give it a two. You know, you get your buck out of it. 30 bucks, not that bad. Probably, if you want to do everything, 15 hours. And uh, the funness. I mean, it was pretty much just like a puzzle game. With, like, the element of these wild creatures. You go around talking to people, bring them back. And uh, I didn't hate it, but I was like, okay, this is cool like it's pretty much like how do I capture this bug snack and some of them were more unique than others you had to like combine traps to like or maybe like even a few traps you had the attention of one by like shooting like chocolate somewhere you put your uh, trap on your launch pad shoot the trap from the launch pad towards it while it's going for like the snack or something you capture it that stuff's cool. But the ending, I just did not like that ending. Like, if they showed, 
don't know why I didn't say this earlier, but if they showed, like, the queen earlier and, like, more of that, like, weird stuff going on, like, you can actually see it, that probably would have made it better. It's like, you didn't see that stuff, like, last half hour. Uh, fun is I'll give it a one. You know, I somewhat enjoyed it. I, the ending was really weird. I, uh, yep. And so that means we have, where is it? A seven out of 10. Not a bad game. Pretty good. You can get it for free on PS plus. I think you could still get it. I'm not sure. It might've, it might've just cut off. Who knows? But anyway, that's the ranking. 7 out of 10. These are the stats. It was a good game. It was an okay game. It was, it was a good game. I would pl- I'll probably play it again to try and platinum it. And um, that's going to do it for this video. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for watching. Uh, I Also, wait, what the hell was that thing at the end? <laughs> Did they expect anything? No. Don't tell me there's going to be sequels or DLCs for this. Was this like a one-off? I don't know if they're going to add anything else to this. Who knows? I might check it out. <laughs> but, um, yeah, if you're watching this later, thanks for watching. Be sure over down below. Leave a sharp share. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.